Hi, my name is Dr. Katie Boss, physical therapist at In Motion OC here in Orange County, California. I'm here today to talk to you about hip bursitis. Bursitis involves the inflammation of the bursa tissue. A bursa is a fluid-filled sac that is positioned between a bone and a tendon and prevents friction. A common bursa that gets inflamed is located on the outside of your hip. Sometimes this occurs due to trauma by falling on the outside of your hip or by repeated activities that include bending and extending uh, the hip here with stairs, increased hiking, running, jogging, and the, and the like. Some common signs and symptoms with hip bursitis include pain on the outside of the hip, pretty pinpoint to where that's located, uh, pain with uh, walking, stair climbing, or even transitional movements like standing from sitting. Oftentimes an individual cannot even lay on that side when they have hip bursitis. A few ways that we can do, uh, that we can treat this issue is by decreasing the tension involved in that, in that surrounding area. I'm gonna show you a stretch that involves stretching the external rotators of our hip. So you're gonna find yourself on the table here, laying down. You're gonna bring one of your legs up towards your chest, just like so. You're gonna translate the knee towards your opposite shoulder here with one arm. And the other arm, you're gonna go ahead and gently pull your ankle towards the wall here. You're gonna to start to feel some tension building on the outside of your hip, holding this for about 30, to 30 seconds to about a minute, a couple times a day. This will help decrease some of that tension that's causing some irritation and compression of the bursa. Hopefully this helps, but if not, and you're still experiencing pain on the outside of your hip, feel free to click on the link below and see if physical therapy can help you start on your road to recovery. Thanks, bye.